Imagine millions of eyeballs seeing and downloading your app. Tons of new users, tons of downloads, and well, tons of money. money, 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 money. <laughs> Today we're diving deeper into the mystical world of app development and the app store. At the end of this video, I'm gonna share with you the single best secret that I learned during my 12 years of app development experience in getting featured worldwide. So stay tuned and until then make sure to like, subscribe and comment on this video if you have any questions or if you want to share something with me. Ready? Let's go! The first thing is to be a trendsetter. From chat GPT based apps to image enhancing just stay tuned on the latest trends because there is quite some appetite for those from people, from users and from the App Store editors as well. The editorial team is always searching for things that are trending on a global scale, such as on social media, on TikTok, on Instagram. So make sure to check the hashtags and to check what people are searching for over there as well. If your app is on that trending bandwagon, then thumbs up, you have a better chance than anybody else to get featured. The second thing is to use Apple's latest SDKs, APIs and operating systems. Apple absolutely loves it when developers integrate their latest APIs. So make sure to check out every new API that Apple releases and see if it makes sense for your app to adopt these new APIs in an intelligent way so that you can either improve the user experience or showcase a feature that otherwise might have been impossible to develop. Right now, from my experience, Vision OS is a major priority. Money, 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 money. Point number three, make sure your app is sexy. What I mean by that is to have an app that has its own personality, it looks beautiful, and it behaves in a way by animations and transitions that make it unique. By the way, I made another video last week where we talk about transforming an existing app from ugly to sexy. So make sure to check out that link after you finish watching this video. Point number four, stunning screenshots. Just imagine this, you have your dating app open and then you, you swipe left and right. Would you swipe right on a photo which is blurry and of low quality. Exactly that is what I mean by having stunning screenshots for the App Store product page. Make sure your screenshots showcase a story, showcase what the app is all about. Make sure to have them beautifully designed by either you, your designer, that users can understand within a snap, within seconds. Otherwise, you will lose important impressions that might as well have been downloads for your app. Point number five user reviews. Reviews and ratings are the currency of the App Store. Make sure to ask users for ratings and reviews as fast as possible within the initial user journey and then make sure to reply to every single review so that people who visit your product page know that you care about your users and that you really take what you're doing seriously. The more love you receive, the higher are the chances that your app might grace the front page of the App Store, which is a big deal. Point number... Point number six. Analytics. Dive into user behavior and track conversions. The more you understand your users, the better it is for your app because your app will become more useful, more valuable to them. Just think about it in this way. The more your current users use the application, the higher it will rank on the app store because of usage. Create a gorgeous app preview. Sometimes app previews don't work, so you have to test it for your niche, for your product, for your use case. I would say to just focus because these 30 seconds of the app preview are super important and focus on what matters the most, benefits and features about your app, and then try to create an app preview video that reflects just that. The next point that I want you to talk to you about called in-app events. This is a great feature whenever you have a massive app update that you want to let your users know and to appear more in the search results. This last tip which is not known by many developers, will definitely increase your chances to get featured on the App Store. Let Apple know. Apple has a dedicated page just to inform them if something major is happening with your app or if you have a new app that is worth talking about. Just please go to Apple Promote 
link in the description and fill out all the information that they request so that you might get a better chance at getting featured. Do this as often as possible with a reason. Think about what are you going to say, what technologies are you using. If you have an important story, a personal story that you would like to share with the editorial team and then just hit that submit button. My personal recommendation is to create a presentation with images and with quick explanations. If you have a test flight link, that is even better. The App Store editorial team do a great job at filtering and at finding out apps that are worth being featured on the App Store. Then if Apple is considering to promote your app, then you might receive an email. The first time that I got this email, my heart just stopped for a minute. I mean, I still can remember that emotion and that feeling that, oh my God, Apple is featuring us. Oh my God, okay, it's happening. Everybody stay calm. Getting featured is an amazing thing. It uh, opens up so many possibilities. Uh, it helps with sales as well. It helps with discovery as well. Just try to make an app which is feature worthy. If you like this video, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, take care. Ciao, ciao. Thanks for being here. Enjoy your evening or your day, depending on where you are and when are you watching this video. Ciao.